Hello. Could you introduce yourself? I'm Tiffany and I'm Susanna Cole's PA. Um, what's that like? <laughs> fast pace. <laughs> but I like fast pace. So backtrack, how long have you worked so far at Point of Video with TGPC? Coming up to three years. Yeah. And uh, you've uh, worked in two different departments so far, now you're in the third department. Yes, I am, yeah. I've been moving um, around. And what's that given you? An insight to all the different three departments. It's also given me skills in different areas yeah. and shows where my areas of weakness and strengths are, which is good as you progress in life and also career-wise. Totally, yeah. totally. So now, what happens? What's your day job uh, looking like? Making sure that you're okay. <laughs> <laughs> Making sure if you've got any meetings or et cetera, everything's done in advance, letting you know where you need to be and et cetera. And also just double checking with the team and making sure like if anything's going on that I know in advance what's going to happen and relaying that back to you so we can plan ahead. Yeah. Yeah. And we've been working on a project for refinancing 13 properties recently. Yes, we have. And uh, how long has that project taken? Over a month. I think, I think we started it in January. January, yeah, we started it. And it's now in April? Oh, wow, so longer than that then. Yeah. 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 And how much paperwork has been involved in refinancing? A lot of paperwork. Literally a lot of paperwork. My desk is probably, I wouldn't say the dirtiest, but there's a lot of papers on my desk, yeah. So it's a huge amount, isn't it? We, Definitely. We, we've um, talked through what did you help prepare, things like the surveyor packs, the insurance, the interest noted, all of that stuff. So with the surveyor packs, um, what I used to do was basically, if it's for property that we're currently renting out, so yeah. I'd make sure I put in an advert in there for them so they're aware. If we have a tenant moving in, also give them a copy of the contract so they can see what the rently income is. Yeah. The monthly, sorry, income is. And just also evaluations as well. So I slipped that in with them. Um, where do the evaluations come from? From estate agents. Okay. Yeah. And have they visited or desktop valuations? Some of them visited, some of them did desktop valuation, but we promote more desktop instead. Sure. Yeah. And is that is that just because otherwise we're taking up the estate agents' time? Yeah, really? definitely. Just obviously their time, you know, going out to other places as well. So most of them are just glad enough to do a desktop valuation oh, for grand, us. Grand. So we're not saying this is definitely the value, but we're saying here's an indication yeah. from a number of estate agents. Here's the ASD, here's the rental. So it's highly likely you're going to get a level of agreement probably from the surveyor. Definitely, yeah. Now let's talk about the cases that we've loved. Um, I don't know if you want to start because <laughs> it's a quite an emotional one for me. <laughs> <laughs> so we had a property where we had oh, oh uh, submitted every single piece of yes. administration needed mm -hmm. to revalue this property to get the survey in to get the refinancing done yeah and they said we want you to do a tiny bit of uh damp, damp yeah i think it was was it 700 quid yes yeah no problem at all got that um, in booked in straight away yeah it, up. it happened then they said we want a certificate and you got that got that one and then they said they would give me a certificate for insurance to back up the works that had been done uh-huh mm -hmm. and that was four weeks ago four weeks ago okay so that was the only piece of paper outstanding and how long did it take to get four weeks and what actions did you take to make that happen calling emails calling went past the bristol branch went up to the high level to the point where from nine o'clock to quarter to five on the phone consistently and got what I needed just before quarter to five, just before end of play. And, and what was I saying to you by that point? Come on, keep on going, keep on going, keep on going. Don't just, get off the phone. Yeah. Don't get off the phone. I Why are you off the phone? Get back on the phone. <laughs> get off the, get on the phone, get on the phone. No, tell them your boss is right here, giving you the evils, get off the phone. And that's exactly what I told them. Yeah. She's here. I don't want to be on the phone to you. You don't want to be on the phone to me. Give me what I need. So what we're really saying is, um, it takes grit uh -huh. sometimes. Um, these guys delay the funding of a project by a month mm -hmm. by, by giving us a certificate, but then not writing one little piece of paper that said this is an insurance-backed certificate for a month. Yeah. And in the end, you literally stayed on the phone for an entire day yep. to get it, or we still wouldn't have it now. No. So really, it's grit. Mm -hmm. It's sheer grit, sheer determination, and the ability to manage the hassle factor sometimes yeah. that makes people succeed in property. Mm -hmm. Is that the shiny, swanky, millionaire oh, stuff we talk about? Clearly not. No, <laughs> no, no one has no idea. <laughs> that's, what, that's what we say, isn't it? Yeah. Like, sometimes folks, I don't mean they've got no idea, but like they've no idea how mundane all of this yeah. stuff is. Mm -hmm. 
So any last minute piece of advice to people having gone through a month of grit to get one piece of paper? You're not the only one who goes through it. <laughs> <laughs> Just keep on going as annoying as it is and as frustrating as it is. Keep on going, keep on pushing. Make them aware that, you know, the easier, you know, I'm trying to help them get you off the phone. So literally just make them aware that this is all you need. You're gonna keep on calling, you're gonna keep on bugging and as much as you don't want it, we just want the situation to be ended. So just keep on going. I know sometimes you, you just wanna put the phone down and shout, just keep on going, have lots of cups of teas, hot chocolate, chocolate, whatever you want. And just, I keep saying it, just keep on going. Thank you. Yeah. Thank you very much. All I'm right. Glad then. you got the paper. Yeah. We were near left crying, weren't we? Definitely was. But we got it. Yes. Well done. All right. See Bye. you guys. Bye.